こんにちは、アイです。Hello, my name is Ai. I'm a Japanese mom who lives in Southern California with my two girls and my partner. In this video, I'm gonna introduce Japanese home cooking. Keywords are easy, simple, yummy, and Japanese. I,、uh, Japanese people believe in, believe in this particular food provides、uh, stamina, vitality, and it increases the、uh, appetizer during hot summer day. And what is this particular food? じゃーんうなぎうなぎ or eel うなぎ is a fresh water eel and by the way アナゴ is a sea water eel うなぎ is full of nutrition good quality of protein calcium and all kinds of、um, Vitamin. So people eat、um, all year around. People eat unagi all year around, but especially end of July, people,、uh, Japanese people, love eating、uh, eel because they, they believe、uh, it provides the、uh, stamina or vitality. And today, I'm gonna introduce how to prepare hitsumabushi, hitsumabushi using a、uh, Um, this unagi, special, this unagi is from Japan.、ねuh, I got this very delicious special、uh, eel from Japan. So, using this、uh, unagi, I'm gonna sh- show you how to prepare hitsumabushi.、Eh, hitsumabushi. hitsumabushi is a traditional Japanese food from Nagoya City in Aichi Prefecture. So it's a it came local food.、ね、And then, hitsu. hitsu is like this. おひつ、うでんぼう、うでんコンテナ、え、まぶす、is mixed。so you place the steamed rice and then place the sliced、sliced うなぎ、ね、and then it comes with all kinds of condiments and garnish。so you might think oh it's just a うなぎどんぶり、ね、but ひつまぶし is different because、um, you enjoy、uh, ひつまぶし or this、uh, うなぎ with b o w in four ways.、ね、four ways. First, you eat as it is. Second, eat with garnish. And third, you enjoy with a hot dashi broth or green tea or some tea. So you、uh, put the dashi, hot dashi, dashi broth or tea in a, a, a teapot and then pour and then eat. So、uh, that's the third. And then, fourth one is your choice. You can choose among all these three previous options. You can choose your favorite. So, when you eat hitsumabushi, you divide, the, uh, divide into four, and then first as it is, second with garnish, third portion with the, uh, broth, and then fourth, you choose whatever you like. So, it's like a Little ceremony and it's fun. So, today I'm gonna demonstrate, I'm gonna share with you how to prepare dashi first. So, dashi,、uh, I already made video, but today I'm gonna make it again. And how to prepare dashi, and then how to prepare or how to make、uh, store bought packed unagi or eel、uh, tasty, how to make it tasty, more tasty. And this one, Today, this one is from Japan and this is really high quality one. But sometimes in,、uh, uh, in, the Amer- in the United States, you just go to grocery store and then buy frozen one. So I will show you how to make it more tasty. And then, three, third, I will show you how to make tare, tare or unagi sauce. Finally, I will demonstrate how to enjoy, how to eat hitsumabushi. So, enough of talking. Let's see how to prepare Hitsumabushi. And if you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you have a request for future menu, please write it down on the comment section down below. Today I got very special, very special、uh, unagi from Japan. So this unagi looks small,、uh, but for regular、uh, store bought unagi from package, It can be two serving. But today,、uh, my recipe is for one serving. And you need、uh, one package of unagi and three tablespoons of sake to steam, steam the unagi. And two, for tare or sauce, you need a tablespoon of sugar. 
three tablespoon of soy sauce, one tablespoon of sake, and three tablespoon of mirin. This is for sauce. And for、uh, dashi or broth, you need a、uh, five times five inch kelp or kombu, two handful of bonito flakes, and And two cups of water. So this is for dashi. And you add, after making dashi, you add one teaspoon of soy sauce. And for garnish or condiments, this is yuzu kosho, a paste made of chili pepper, yuzu skin, yuzu stress skin, and salt. And after that, it's fermented. Very good、uh, seasoning. And wasabi. And chopped green onion, and shiso leaf, and nori or roasted seaweed. And these are optional, you can choose your condiments. So let's make dashi.、Uh, place、uh, two cups of, cups of water and kombu, add kombu, and you turn on the heat. And right before I start boiling, remove the kombu. And then add two handful of bonito flakes and wait until it starts boiling. You see the bubbles in the hot water. And then once it starts boiling,、uh, turn off the heat. Turn off the heat and wait for five minutes. Turn off the heat and wait for five minutes. And after that,、uh, you're gonna drain. So, again,、uh, five minutes. Wait for five minutes and we're gonna drain. Turn off the heat and wait for five minutes and drain. And this is the dashi stock. And for the、uh, hitsumabushi broth, we're gonna add the flavor. So, add one teaspoon of soy sauce and one teaspoon of、uh, salt. And broth. Broth is ready for hitsumabushi. And we're gonna make tare, tare, sauce. Unagi sauce. So uh, add um, in a frying pan, add one tablespoon of sake.、Uh, in this video, I heat it up too much, so it's splashing. But one tablespoon of sake and、uh, three tablespoons of mirin. And we are、uh, evaporating or removing the extra alcohol from mirin and sake. So once、uh, it starts boiling, Uh, add sugar. Add sugar and then soy sauce. And cook over a、uh, medium heat. Cook until it starts bubbly and until it gets a little bit thick. <laughs> Thick. But once it's cooled down, it gets thicker, so don't overcook. Cook until it gets thicker, concentrated. And tare is ready. Now、uh, let's prepare eel. So heat the frying pan to medium heat and then skin side down. Make sure skin side down. And add three tablespoons of sake. And sake remove the、uh, smell of eel, especially like a frozen one in a package. And then press the lid and cook for three minutes, about three minutes. And then unagi gets really nice and soft. And place on a kitchen paper towel and remove the excess、uh, sake. sake on the bottom. Now we're gonna place it in an oven toaster. toaster. So place it in an aluminum foil. And again, skin side down. Skin side down. And then spread some、uh, tare. I don't have a, a pastry brush, so I'm spreading spoon with spoon. And then we're gonna toast、uh, about three minutes. 
you check, you check all the time. Don't try not to get get it burnt. And the cut <laughs> looks nice and juicy and soft. Unagi is ready. And then hitsumabushi usually uh, when you sub, you cut into small pieces. So cut it into small pieces. So now we are getting ready to serve and uh, broth. Broth, uh, we prepare the broth and then uh, heat up, heat up the broth. And place it in uh, uh, the hot broth, <laughs> place it in a teapot. I'm dropping, uh, but be careful. And then place the steamed very uh, fresh rice, just prepared rice in a bowl or a ohitsu, ohitsu, wooden container. And then press some more uh, tare, unagi no tare. And then press the cut eel, cut unagi. And then I already press the condiment or garnish in a small plate, uh, green onion, uh, shiso leaf, seaweed, yuzu kosho, and wasabi. So, hitsumabushi is ready to serve. Hai, eh, oishi hitsumabushi. Very delicious hitsumabushi ga dekimashita. So, I'm gonna demonstrate how to eat. So this is dashi, dashi broth and condiments, condiments, uh, shiso leaf, green onion, uh, seaweed, and this one, uh, yuzu kosho, and wasabi. And first, as I mentioned, uh, we gonna divide the shitsumabushi into four portions. So four portion, four portion, quarter, yeah, quarter. And first, I'm gonna enjoy just as it is. So put on a plate. So mabusu means mix. So mix a little bit, and then, じゃ いただきます. うん、美味しい。このうなぎ本当に美味しいです。タレもいいね。うん。And <笑> second part. Second part. Uh, you eat with all garnish and cond You eat with all garnish and condiments. So little bit of yuzu kosho and some wasabi I'm gonna put everything and little bit green onion and little bit of shiso leaf shiso leaf mm. kalai nori nori ne seaweed and じゃあ食べてみます これも美味しそうだね Zenbu mix stika, zenbu no sete, I'm gonna put ev eat everything together. Mm. Oh, mm. oh, 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 I like adding a little bit of yuzu kosho, yuzu kosho and wasabi again. Seka ochazuke ne. Nori. Everything again. Green onion and shiso leaf. Hai, oisso. Itadakimasu. Mmm, ne koe. Mmm. だしが効いてて美味しい。この
ちょっとうんうまいよ Very good And then fourth part is your choice You can choose from、uh, uh, last three parts、uh, You can eat as it is with garnish or with dash broth And I like the one with dash broth so I'm gonna try now And、uh, like I mentioned、uh, Hitsumabushi is like a little ceremony, like a tea ceremony. And it takes lots of preparation, but it's really fun. So,、uh, if you have got a chance to go to Japan,、uh, try, try to Hitsumabushi. Or please, please try、uh, to make at home. Hi, ありがとうございました Mata ne.